What's up YouTube, welcome back to another video right here on the channel of Tubers Gaming HD. So we're back in Farm Simulator 2019 once again and we are back here to actually show you guys some new mods that we got today. So I surely hope that you guys have watched my previously uploaded videos. As I said before, I'm going to be more consistent in the uploading. So please go ahead and hit the thumbs up on this video. I think we can actually get one like. That would be really cool. So again, also if you're not yet a subscriber to the channel, please go ahead and subscribe by clicking the red button on this video to actually go ahead and do that. So let's get into this right here. We do have some, you can actually see right now, we do have some trailers or some tibbers, which is brand new for the game. So let's get into it right here from White Bolt Modding. This is the Jeskin Wacko Loader and it is basically just a flat bed wagon which can actually like transport machines, it can transport bales and different kind of stuff. Then we have the Bergman K-Rex 38S from Baki. This Bergman right here is basically just a pickup. Uh, it, it picks up like grass and stuff like that. And um, yeah, you can see the price right here, 83,000 euros and max working speed on 20 kilometers per hour. Capacity is 38,000 liters, which is really cool. Then we have this SIP Pino from BGA, Bgamer 003 or 003. And the SIP Pino 20 right here has a price in 3,400. Max working speed is 20 kilometers per hour and the required power is 40 horses under the bonnet. So capacity is 20,000 liter right here. We're gonna go ahead and install that too. Uh, didn't I install that? No, we're just gonna go ahead and do that. So then we got the Lizard Arm TP240, which has a price in 31,000 euros. Capacity is 17,000 liters, which is like pretty decent, I guess. And uh, we're also gonna go ahead and install that, of course. We're gonna show you guys all the new ones. And then we have the Lizard Arm 140 right here, which is like a bigger tipper than the Lizard Arm TP240. So we're gonna go ahead and actually get that also. We do also have the Lizard K150 from LDM Studio right here. And it is basically a legendary trailer of Finnish agriculture, ideal for your small and medium sized farm. She will accompany you in all the work, which is kind of cool. So this is like, oh, that's an old gen deer right there. I would actually love one of those old gen deers in the game. That would be really cool. Then we have the Amazon AD302 right here from Das Alex, which is basically a cedar. And um, yeah, function of this mod, sewing machine and power hammer can be detached, but you need to be bought separately. Connection hoses. So category is power harrows and actually Amazon AD305 is in cedars. I'm gonna go ahead and buy that too. So that we got all the mods from today showcased in this video right here, guys. So let's go ahead. It is downloaded right now. So let's get into career mode and let's get into the save game number three, where I do actually showcase new mods for you guys. So let's go ahead and start it up. Deselect all and select all and let's get in the game. So while we're actually waiting for it to load right here, you guys have plenty of opportunities to go ahead and hit the thumbs up. I think, or I surely hope so, that we're already on the one like. So let's just kind of get it up to 10, I guess. So the goal is now 10 likes on this video. So please go ahead and hit the thumbs up, guys. Also make sure to subscribe to the channel by clicking that red button if you haven't done that yet which i surely hope you have but i can actually see into the details that a lot of you guys watching is not yet subscribed to the channel so you should definitely go ahead and do so so it is loading right now and we are basically gonna go ahead and get into the game as soon as it is done loading it just takes a lot of time to actually load because of all the mods that needs to be gathered into the game but i think it is okay at the moment i really do so come on man could you please get into this that would be really really cool that would be really cool so 95 percent 95 percent yes sir we're ready to go ahead and start it up so I'm just gonna go like straight into it guys and I'm gonna go ahead and just buy all the stuff that we need to actually showcase this. So a lot of these new mods is gonna be in tippers of course. So let's go ahead and see if we can 
find the lizard OEM, or maybe we can find this right here, the lizard K150, which is looking really cool. And we do have this one also. I'm just gonna get like each of one of them. I'm gonna take them all standard, then the lizard ORM and lizard ORM TP, which actually have a bigger capacity than the other one, which is kind of odd, I think, but it's okay. So that's what we do have right here for that. Then we're gonna go into, we're going into, let me see, let me see. It's not in trailers, it's in loading wagons actually. We should find the Berkman in here, and it is right here, the Carex 38S, that's gonna buy it standard. And then of course we have the SIP Piano. Let's go ahead and find that, it is right there. I'm gonna take that. And then we do have the low bed wagon somewhere. Should be in low loaders, I guess. Yeah, it is. Just getting wacko loader right there. And we're gonna go ahead and buy a tractor to get down there and also to like showcase the much in general. This is gonna be the 7R series right here from John Deere. Nothing special. Uh, right there. So we are now down at the parking lot and you can see we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven new trailers or like at least something that you can put on the back of it. So that is really cool. We do actually have a lot of these right here, which is, it's, I, I think in my opinion, it, it is really nice that we get a lot of new stuff in the game. I actually do believe we get new stuff every single day right here in the game of Farming Simulator, and I do believe that it is pretty nice and pretty awesome. At least that is my thoughts on this, because they actually like renews the game every single day when we get new mods. So right here we should go ahead and take a list at the K150 gold right here, and we also have the K150 right there, and of course. Of course, I cannot get close to these right here, but I think they look really cool. And the low bed wagon there for like machines transporting and stuff like that. And this one right here, the Pioneer Sheep and the Bergman Carex 238S. We do also have the OIM and the other OIM. I think I, I didn't know that the yellow one right here was actually bigger than the red one because it definitely seems the other way. Definitely seems like the red one, like in the real life, is actually bigger than the yellow one. I can't, I can't not figure it out. It has like bigger sides and stuff like that. So why is the yellow one bigger than the, the red one? It doesn't really make any sense to me, guys. It really doesn't. So let's go ahead and get in the 7230R right here. Let's put the red one on. I think it would actually fit perfectly with the Gen Deere hair. I uh, think not, not too big and not too small. I think it would be great. So we're gonna get it on with that, and it is actually looking, as I said, really cool with this. It is really looking awesome. I do actually believe, or oh, I, I do not believe, I think so actually. So that's really cool into this. I don't know what you guys think about these tippers and these trailers right here in general. Do you think they're great? Do you think they're bad? Let me know in the comment section below what your thoughts are on this. I think definitely that it is some good stuff that we can actually see right here when we get like new new stuff uh, every single day. Uh, I think it's really it's really nice to actually get like new things. You're also like feeling like Christmas every single day and. Uh, I think that's a good feeling actually, it really is. So um, yeah, those are like the trailers. But of course I like more when we get like new machines and stuff because it's just it's just something special when we get like new machines. It's, it's something else actually. So, so yeah, I think definitely we're gonna go ahead and end this video right here. And I just wanna say once again thanks for watching on the video. Please go ahead and check out the new mods in the mod hub on Farm Simulator 2019, of course. And also make sure to, uh, yeah, I did say that a lot of times right here through the video, but hit the thumbs up and uh, also make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that. So uh, without further ado, I think it is a
about time to go ahead and end the videos. So thanks for watching and thanks for coming here. Bye guys. Bye.